Japan is famous for sushi, sumo wrestling, samurai, cherry blossom, Fuji mountain, geisha, great hospitality, anime, manga, Godzilla, and also awesome toilet. Today I'm going to prove to you that Japan has the best toilet in the world. For some all in Japan, it's not rare to see a map or signs in front of the toilet telling you exactly what kind of facilities they provide, and sometimes even tell you whether the booths are available or occupied. Japanese toilets are beautiful and clean. It is very rare to find any toilet with unpleasant smell. There's no need to worry about the cleanliness of public toilet. You will find this seat cleaner everywhere and you can use it to wipe the seat before sitting down. Sometimes they also have this kind of paper that you can place on the seat before using and just flush it down afterwards. A lot of toilet in Japan is so automated that you don't have to touch anything. Everyone knows how public toilet can be full of bacteria so this can really help avoiding getting some bacteria on your hands. Japanese toilets are famous for having a lot of buttons and different functions. After you're done with your business, you can press this button and the water will be sprayed at the back area. If you want the water to be sprayed at the front area, press this button. It's possible to adjust the water pressure and sometimes the temperature of the water too. Some toilets even have massage button and dry button. If you are shy about the sound you may make, you can press this button and the sound of flushing water will be played. Just for your information, every toilet is different and if you want to flush the water, you should look for this handle behind the toilet and push it down. Or cover this sign with your hand or press this button on the controller. In Japan, it is very common for women's restroom to have a specific area with big mirrors for makeup and touch up. Here you will also find the space to place your bag or luggage or to put your makeup pouch so it's very convenient. There's normally a full length mirror at the entrance as well so you can check on your outfit. Another great thing about Japanese toilet booth is that there's always a hook for you to hang your coat or bag. This is another thing that you may see in many toilets in Japan. If you need to change your clothes in the toilet, you may find this changing board very useful. All you need to do is to pull it down and stand on there. When you eat out in a restaurant, you may see something like this prepared in the bathroom. As you can see here, we have mouthwash, toothpick, dental floss, cotton bud, and blotting paper. For ladies, some toilets also provide pads for free or even have a vending machine like this. Recently, several bathrooms in Japan start to have brain space as well. Japanese toilet is designed to fit everyone's needs including children. When you are in Japan, you may run into this adorable tiny toilet. It's perfect size for children and even the toilet paper is set at the height that is reachable for them. Some bathrooms may have a baby seat like this so it's really easy for children to use. It's also very common for Japanese toilets to have this kind of baby chair so it's convenient for any mother. They have a lot of diaper changing stations in Japan as well. All you have to do is just to pull this down and place your baby there. Remember to follow the instruction and don't drop or leave your baby. Japan also has a lot of multi-purpose bathrooms. Normally everything here is automatic. Just press the button next to the door and the door will close and get locked by itself. This kind of toilet is designed for people with disabilities so it is always very spacious and has many holding bars. Every toilet is designed in a different way and this specific toilet that I was in had a multi-purpose table for changing clothes and diaper. It is a fold-away table and when I open it, it's actually big enough to fit an adult. By now, I hope you're convinced that Japan has the best toilet in the world. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Subscribe and turn on the bell for more videos about life and travel in Japan. Have a great week and I'll see you next time. Bye bye!